My name is Sahil Aurora. I play Dota 2. My handle is Universe and I grew up in Madison, Wisconsin. Well, I went to high school in Madison and then I started going to college there as well at UW-Madison, but uh, recently I took some time off just to play Dota full-time. I used to play tennis, uh, I used to play chess and stuff like that. All that kind of slowed down once I started playing Dota since uh, I've been putting everything into this and trying to win. Well, I started being interested in games from like a very young age. The first title I can really say I, that really drew me to the game and I started playing a lot was StarCraft. I saw one of my friends playing and I just, I couldn't stop playing it basically. So that was one of the first games that I played. Here with Universe, congratulations on the win. Thank you. Like everyone else, um, I thought I was the best <laughs> when I was playing, even though I probably wasn't very good. But uh, I just started playing a lot and I got recognized by uh, a team called Nirvana International before TI1. And uh, Fear, one of the players on the team right now, um, just asked me to ring for their team and that's kind of how it started. Well, the first tournament I played at, I was pretty nervous, I think. Uh, I didn't really show it too much, but I was nervous and it was crazy. I'd never played in front of a crowd that big before. And the energy of the tournament at first uh, made it so I didn't play as well. But as I kept playing, uh, I really liked the energy from the crowd and it helped me boost my play. Before major tournaments, the training schedule is pretty intense. We would play maybe eight to 10 hours a day, whereas here it's more relaxed. Sometimes you'll play that much, sometimes you would play maybe two to four games a day or something like that. I've kind of taken a small break uh, right after this last international, but uh, the break doesn't last very long. And if you want to keep being the best, then you can't really take much break. My most important win would probably have been this last win that just happened uh, in China. It was my first win at a huge international LAN. I, most of the top teams were competing in this LAN, so it was probably my biggest win so far. No matter how big the event is, uh, I think the focus is the same. So whether there's a million people watching or a thousand, I think uh, you're always just focused on the game. You're not thinking about that. My biggest disappointment as a pro gamer would probably be the International 3. I was on a team um, I kind of got forced into playing with halfway through the year and I didn't feel like I put my 100% effort into it, so after I lost there, it was pretty heartbreaking. After that, I just kind of reevaluated if I really wanted to do this, and at that point I was still in school, so I decided, you know, just to take a year off and uh, do my very best. So, well, the current meta is more like everyone has to group up together and push towers really early, whereas before it might have been a bit more uh, split pushing and stuff like that, but it always changes and whenever things get a bit stale people want new patches and I think right now everyone's waiting for the next patch to come out. Image tearing is a big deal because we always play um, with, on the lowest settings with VSync off just to make sure that the FPS is as high as possible during the game. And I have been testing out this technology on G-Sync monitors for some time now and uh, the difference is pretty huge because split second things uh, can mean the difference between winning a team fight or losing a team fight and avoiding that tearing on the screen. Uh, well, it's, it's huge. The next big thing I'm looking at is the international. Um, it's always been the international. Every year, uh, that's the only thing that the pro players really look towards. It's working towards that, and all the other tournaments in between are kind of like practice for that tournament. Well, I'm feeling pretty confident right now. I feel like our lineup is pretty good, and we're all pretty hardworking, and we all really want to win, so I think we have the recipe.